This Mobile Geeks video is powered by ASUS. Hey, I'm Roland with Mobile Geeks right here at Computex 2015. And what we have right here is basically the real first Windows 10 smartphone coming to market. Because the other day we showed you the Madosma from Japan, which is first launching with Windows Phone 8.1 and then later on switching to Windows 10. Uh, it was advertised by Microsoft at their own um, developer show in Japan as running with Windows 10, but it's actually coming to market with Windows Phone uh, 8.1. This right here is the Cherry Mobile Alpha Prime, and this is for real. It's been announced to be coming with Windows 10, and it is definitely running Windows 10 here on the show floor. It's a low-end device, it's super low price. My guess would be just under 100 euros, maybe 100 bucks, maybe even less. So it's kind of probably gonna be around $79, for example. Cherry Mobile is from the Philippines, so you're not gonna see this in the US, but it's an OEM device that might be launching through other uh, Microsoft partners in other countries. This right here is a four inch screen. We have an IPS panel, so the viewing angles are definitely decent. No color reproduction problems when I'm tilting the device. The resolution is at 800 by 480, so it's WVGA on this device. Under the hood is a Qualcomm Snapdragon 210, so that's the new low-end SoC that's even below the Snapdragon 400 that's been used on many Windows phones. It's a quad-core SoC running at up to 1.1 gigahertz, and it includes an Adreno 304 graphics part. Uh, it has an LTE modem integrated for speeds of up to 150 megabits a second on the downstream. And performance-wise, it's coping pretty well, actually. I mean, if you look at this scrolling stuff, everything seems to work pretty nice. Um, we are running Windows 10 Mobile build uh, 10075. Let me just head into this Microsoft app and check out what it says in the About screen. So there you have it. It's running build 175. Definitely in a pretty much up-to-date build. We're at build on April 29. On the Cherry Mobile Alpha Prime, you get one gig of RAM and eight gigabytes of flash storage. There is a micro SD card slot under this cover back here that you can take off. I'm not gonna take it off because it's all dongled up in the Microsoft alarm system. It's pretty, pretty tight. Uh, there is dual SIM card slots on here, under here. I think there are full size SIM card slots and a micro SD card slot, as I said, for storage, storage extension. The battery in here can be exchanged and it's a 1,500 milliamp hour battery in this case. We have a single speaker at the bottom and the whole thing is made out of plastic. This up here is a five megapixel camera, including a single LED flash. And on the top, you get the micro USB port plus your uh, three and a half millimeter headset jack. This is not a type C port. It's just a standard micro USB. On the side, this is the volume rocker, and the click point is actually very nice. It feels pretty high quality in this case. We have the power button underneath that also working pretty well. Nothing on the bottom. This is the space where you can just tear off the cover right here. There you go. And you get some capacitive touch buttons on the front on this device, so these are not going to go away with Windows 10 Mobile. Um, on the left, there is pretty much nothing. The whole thing weighs in at 130 grams, and my guess would be that the thickness is at around or just under or just over 10 millimeters. So this has been just a very, very quick first look at the very first Windows 10 smartphone here at Computex 2015. I'm Roland with Mobile Geeks with the Cherry Mobile Alpha Prime, and if you like what we do on our channel, subscribe. Give us a thumbs up, follow us on Twitter, Facebook, and Google+, and we will see you later. Bye-bye, guys. This Mobile Geeks video is powered by ASUS.